Smoke and mirrors, baby. That's the movie business. Yeah, it's all about the mind fuck and believing in it. So, Mm -hmm. and I love it though because it's like it's so good, it's so lucrative. I mean, the guys love it, and also you know they get to come to it and they enjoy it. So it goes both ways, really. And for me, I get off on it too. I get off on it. It's fun. It's so much. Yeah, just going to the movie theater and like you know actually about to do it. And not really doing it there, but like yeah. the fact that you know you get this rush. Oh, I love yeah, it. I fucking love it. Yeah, <laughs> and it must be fun as well to be able to produce your own content and come up with your own ideas and not like have to come to set and yeah. be given a script and being like, okay, this is what you have to do for somebody else. Absolutely, I find so. It, it's so much easier to do my own thing. So it's less time and it's more rewarding for me because I have the content I'm making the the money of it and also you know benefiting from it because I can reuse the content for different platform and um mm. make way more money than um an actual set because because we don't have residuals on set so right at least I can use my own content and do that but I will yeah. I do shoot for companies just not as often as I want anymore I mean not as often as I I, I it's it's a hit and miss it depends on what the project is for me, I think it's just the fact that I know for my own content, I could do I do so well that mm. having to be on set for so and so amount of time, where I could just do it myself and within an hour or two, you know, do the same and make way more. And it's more rewarding for me because you know I'm producing it, I'm shooting it, I am I have my talent with me. I'm it's all me and it's it's fun and I get off on yeah. it so. I think that for me is a huge factor, huge factor. Yeah. Huge factor. I mean, there's a lot of talk right now, especially, you know, with, I think COVID has, you know, obviously forced people to quarantine. So yeah. porn is kind of been shut down. Girls have been forced to shoot more of their own content. And I think they've gotten a better handle on how to market and sell it. Absolutely. So a lot of people are feeling more empowered and feeling that they make more money producing their own content I mean, I see so many girls saying like, I'm not coming back to shoot for studios anymore. I'm just not doing it. I'm going to do my own content. And, you know, there are people that are talking about like porn is dead and the studio model is dead and it's just going to be only fans from here on out. What do you think about that? Do you think that that's true? Um, For certain girls who've built their brand already, I think that's going to be true. But we still need the porn for the new girls to build up their name and get their name out there. But for the girls who are established and they have a name and bigger name girls, I'm pretty sure that's, if they're saying that, then I, I, I think they're going to do that. But like for the new girls, they need that, those shoots, those scenes to be out there in the public so that they can build their name. But Mm -hmm. yeah, so we're going to see way more new girls for sure on that. But yeah, I think for a lot of established girls, that's going to be the new way. Because, I mean, they've yeah. been doing it for three months now, making their own money, you know, with yeah. their own content. And they've probably built a system of how they're making their money. And I'm sure there's so many girls struggling because they don't know how to really do it. Or, you know, so those girls are going to go back to porn. And the girls who have their system and, and check already, and they're making, you know, so-and-so. And sky's the limit with platform. You can make as much as you want, but you have to really – put in the time and effort and really, you know, sell it and promote it. That's the thing. And I think that that's where some girls are going to fall short because it is a hustle. I mean, you have to work. That shit is not handed to you and it is a competitive market. So um, if you're willing to do all that work, then yes, you can support yourself and you don't need the big name studios. But if you're not, then, you know, probably a healthy mix of doing studio work for people that you want to work for, where you get like a guaranteed paycheck, you get your name out there. And then also shooting your own content works for some girls. I just think it's different for everybody. Or um, Fan Central, when I was a unicorn, which I still am, but when it wasn't getting deleted all the time, I was in the six mm. figure mark, the mark every month. Six figure yeah. marks on Snapchat. Yeah, people people can't believe it when I tell them that. Yeah, it's that, true. that girls can make that much money. Like yeah. it blows their mind. It's just they don't believe it, but it's it's possible. There's girls yeah. I know a girl named Britannia and she makes two hundred thousand a month on Snapchat, you know? But she doesn't yeah. shoot porn. I mean she shoots porn but just only her stuff. And she's yeah. a reality T V star for VH one and stuff like that. So 
You have yeah. to really market yourself. It's all about branding and promoting yourself, and you can really make a lot of money. So, yeah. And there's YouTubers now. YouTubers and OnlyFans and Snapchat, and they're making a lot of money as well. So it's all about branding, branding yourself. This is true. This is true. Yeah, for myself, this whole quarantine has been a wonderful opportunity to focus on marketing for my podcast and that kind of thing. So um, I, the the forced slowdown from work's actually, I think, been beneficial to make a lot of people more realize that they could be more independent, which is great. You know, it's yeah. important to have, I think, the shift of power into the hands of the performers is a really good move. You know, evens the playing field, gives them more more say in their work, um, it gives them more value. And I think these are all really good things. Absolutely. And 